How's it going everybody? Zero the Painter here. Today we're working on a viewer inspired painting. The Tusken Raider Sand People from Star Wars. First we start out with a background of brown. We just do some random lines just to support the painting. Next we start with a basic shape. This can be adjusted later as we do detail. I do this to support the other colors we're going to add to the figure. Next we're going to start drawing in lightly. We're going to start with basic, a basic road map to tell us where to go. I like to start with the eyes and work my way down. Now this is just a basic outline to show me where I'm going to put the parts. Now I start to fill in the lightest parts of the picture first. I do the light parts so that I can go darker and darker. With oil paints, you always work from the light to the dark. The layers will pick up the color from each other, so you always want to go light to dark because the painting is going to get darker by itself. Now I like to work from top to bottom because that gives the oil paint a chance to dry. We'll fill in the bottom parts here, then we'll go back in and work on the face. Now we go back in with a burnt umber, start to fill in the brown. We'll go back in with some black, start to darken things. Now we're just barely detailing things now. We have a long way to go. Tuscans, or sometimes called sand people, were the native population of Tatooine. They're a nomadic sentient tribe that is often hostile to settlers. Now we're going to start to do shadows. Each wrap has its own shadow. Each shadow has its own highlight, so first we do the dark parts, then we go back in and highlight the shadows on top with white. Now we're still in the preliminary stages here of drawing the figure, so we can change things if we need to. Now we keep adding detail with black. I like to work from the center out. This helps to keep your hands out of the paint. From time to time I'll also use a support stick to keep my hands out of the paint. You simply lean one end of the stick to the outside of the painting and support your hand. Now we have to be careful when we use black because it can take over the whole painting. A lot of times instead of using black I'll use a really dark brown like sienna. In multiple layers, sienna can get darker and darker. But to achieve actual black, you'll have to use a lamp black or an, an ivory black. Now here you can see I will use a support stick to keep my hands out of the wet paint. You can paint a lot faster when you're holding your hands above the wet paint. This allows me to add in final details over the wet paint, which helps to mix the colors. Now when you're painting with oils, unless you're mixing the colors, it's best to let them dry. This can take several hours, so sometimes I use a hair dryer to help with the drying process. The use of the support stick will help you to get finer detail in any painting. I'll do a video on how to build a support stick later. It's basically just a stick with a ball on the end that keeps you from scratching the painting. Now we're going to go in and detail the hands and body, adding shadows and light. Now you can tell they built the Tuscan from basically old scraps they had laying around, some garden gloves, some welding goggles. Now we just keep adding detail on top of detail. We're going dark first, we're going to go back in and highlight everything. Do you paint or do you draw with pencils? What kind of art do you do? Leave a comment and share your talent. Here we go with more dark. We fill in the top of the head. Now we go back in with lamp black. Lamp black is a very dark black that will cover most things. It's a thicker paint. Now we're getting close to our complete and final detail. 
from here on I will take a very fine point black and add the very tight lines. This will sharpen the picture. Very sharp fine point with very little paint on. Helps you make a very fine line. Next I go back in with the white highlights. And that's about it for this guy. There you have it, a Tuscan Raider, sand people. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching. Please click like and subscribe. Thanks.